The Sunday after Thanksgiving is usually one of the busiest travel days of the year, and today was no different. Many people who visited family or friends are now heading home. Eyewitness News reporter Madeline Wright has the story from Philadelphia International Airport. Airport workers guided passengers to the back of a huge line at Philadelphia International Airport on one of the busiest travel days of the year. Many passengers caught in the morning rush were glad to miss the rain as they left for home. I always try to get an early start because I know these things happen. I'd rather be early than than late. Despite the soggy forecast, most departing flights at PHL this morning were on time, though one flight to Altoona was delayed. Some arriving flights from Charlotte, Richmond, and Plattsburgh were delayed as well. I woke up around 5 this morning. It left uh, 30 minutes prior, and then, you know, you see the lines all the way, all the way to the back, like the lady over there was singing. <laughs> so, yeah, just uh, anticipating a two hour wait time. The airport says it's not expecting passenger volume to reach pre pandemic levels, but it is still going to be busier than the same time last year. It's stressful. I'm three hours early for my flight because I want to have enough time. An estimated 85,000 passengers are expected to travel through the airport today. With Thanksgiving behind them, folks are getting ready to go back to school or work first thing tomorrow morning. It's sad, especially since I have to go home to a lot of studying, um, but I'm grateful for the time I had with my family. Many people are planning to come back to the Delaware Valley to spend time with family for Christmas. At PHL, Madeline Wright, CBS3 Eyewitness News.